Yeah, so let's say this is the Green Valley community of Arlington. We're just off of 395 and South Glebe Road. In fact, the Army Navy Country Club just on the other side of, of uh, South Glebe Road here. So it was about 830 tonight that Arlington police started getting reports of shots fired here in this neighborhood just along a row of townhouses. So officers arrive on the scene quickly thereafter, not knowing what they're going to encounter. And sure enough, they encounter a man, an adult male in his 40s, still actively firing a weapon. Officers quickly get out of the car, confront this suspect, order him to drop the weapon. He doesn't, instead sort of raises the weapon and levels it. And that's when one officer opens fire, hitting that suspect. The suspect then quickly taken into custody, transported to an area hospital where we're told right now he is in stable condition. Two officers also transported to a hospital as well, just for evaluation. It doesn't appear appear that anyone else other than the suspect was physically harmed here. So now what unfolds from here? A regional CERT team, which is a critical incident response team, will then come in and investigate this. This is a team that investigates things like police involved shootings, in death custody, police uh, suicides. They do this so as you don't have one agency investigating its own officers in a police involved incident. So this regional CERT team is made up of officers from 11 different police agencies here in Northern Virginia. So they will step in and investigate things. That is all the details that we have on this right now. So we don't know what more uh, that we can give you that that suspect was up to. But as police give us information, we are in close contact with him. We'll be able to update those details overnight and into the morning on WSA9.com. We're live in Arlington tonight. Adam Longo, WUSA9.